Hello guys, welcome back to my channel where we discuss popular mainstream music and in this episode we're going to be talking about Megan Thee Stallion and how she has started this trend of diss rapping in 2024 which we've seen a lot about, okay? And we're going to get into it but before we do, if you enjoyed the little snippet of music in the beginning of this music video music video in this video <laughs> in general that is my single check it out okay you can check it out here on youtube just type my name sam dolphin and you can listen to my music on all um, music streaming platforms so definitely check it out i'd appreciate it a lot so now getting back into this video megan the stallion and how she has started this trend of diss rapping okay so lately we've seen a lot of diss rapping okay Kendrick over you know J. Cole and Drake and then we've seen Chris Brown going with Quavo and then we've seen um Lotto with Ice Spice uh, okay um there's just so many diss tracks going on even Taylor Swift <laughs> going you know so people are trying to figure out where did this trend started who started it and i'm here to tell you guys it is megan the stallion because the his diss record was the first official diss record of 2024 okay so let's just start there you can figure it out by starting out with the first diss track which was his his is the first popular diss track to come out 2024 and what was big about this diss track is it hit everybody in the industry but it really triggered one of the big goats in the industry, Nikki, um, and got her spiraling and got her going crazy and turned, you know, it got so big that the song went number one. I mean, just a huge moment for Megan Thee Stallion. <clears throat> and people were just shocked about the amount of like controversy and, and just the intensity and how it, you know, got Nikki in a whole spiral and just Twitter after Twitter, blogs after blogs, like it really created a whole sensation, okay? Because no one was really able to get Nikki like that, especially in a rapping way. So this is where it started. And then you started seeing other rappers dissing other people. Then you got Kendrick calling, you know, Drake and everyone out. Then you got, you know, Chris Brown, you know, going for Quavo. Um, you know, you had um, even Lotto with um, Ice Spice when they were going at it. You know, a lot of this happened. It's like it started like a fire. And that initiation, I'm telling you, started with Megan The Stallion. I'm telling you, it did because it was the first one and it blew the court and got everyone going. So I just think we got to give props to Megan The Stallion uh, for starting this trend. And I'm not even surprised because Megan is an Aquarius and Aquarius are known for being rebellious and innovative. You know, they start new things, they start trendy things and they're rebellious. Because if you look at Megan The Stallion, she's the only female rapper to get Nicki in a rapping way. Okay, okay, you got Remy Ma too. You got Remy Ma too. Let's give credit to Remy Ma. Okay, but Megan of the newer crop female rappers is the girl to do it. And the girl who had the guts, and not only the guts to do it, but the bars to do it. Okay, the Megan's Law line really got people looking. And the other lines for all the other men, like the D, um, the BBL line for Drake and all that, those hit too, you know. But of course, you know, Nicki really reacted crazy because Nicki's the queen of rap. She's such a big legend. Um, for Nikki who um, for Megan who's a small artist to hit her like this is a big deal and really got a lot of attention going um, and it just shows to it, it just it's a testament to her rapping skills I always say that Megan Thee Stallion is the best female rapper of the newer generation like when it comes to her rapping skills she has the bars she has the quickness and she also can freestyle rap and I feel like none of the female rappers um, none of the new female rappers um, not that they don't have the ability but I don't think any of them would have went the way Megan has and that's what stands her out like a sing gal say for the streets get dropped like a sing gal run wait shit i do not do the retail stop fucking rappers they spill all the details every monday they um and that's why i feel like people followed through um after that so i definitely think megan started this um dish trend um for 2024 being that she was the first one to put out this major mainstream dish track of 2024 and it hit one of the big goats Nicki minaj okay 
that causing a huge, huge controversy, lots of media, lots of buzz, lots of people talking, that kind of started, and I feel like that what fueled a lot of these diss tracks going on in hip hop, and just in music in general, because even Taylor Swift got a diss track, <laughs> so tell me what you guys think. Uh, you know, people don't want to give Megan her props and her credit. This girl is an Aquarius. She is innovative, okay? You know, you could discredit as much as you want, but one thing you can't say is that she doesn't have bars. She definitely has bars. Um, she has that credibility, and she has the rapping skills to back up what she's doing, okay? And that's why she can go against um, the greats like that in that certain type of way, so... Tell me who do you guys think started this diss trend? What do you guys think about Meg and her diss track starting this trend? Do you agree? Do you disagree? Do you have other people in mind? Let me know in the comment section below. And also, do you think this diss track is testament to Megan's talent? Okay. Could have you seen anybody else doing a diss track like this? Let me know in the comment section below and I'll check you guys out on the next video.